Ukitel comes out with the $50 smartphone, Verni broadcasts new trials of its Apollo Light, and Hyperloop is looking to reduce China to Europe train transit times by nearly 2,000%. I'm Tim Machu and this is Tech China. Sunshine-based Ukitel has come out with a 5-inch 720p display smartphone for only $50. The Ucatel C3 is great value for money, and while the specs and sounds are nothing to brag about, its overall performance is pretty good and a real bang for your buck. For the price of one-fifth of an iPhone 6, you get a quad-core 1.3 GHz CPU operating with 1 GB of RAM and 8 GB of expandable storage. The largely plastic handset has a removable backplate to reveal dual SIM card slots as well as a micro SD card port. A 2-megapixel front-facing camera is backed by an 8-megapixel shooter on the rear, it's Wi-Fi and GPS ready, and the C3 is powered by a 2,000mAh battery. Neighboring handset producer Verni has put its Apollo Light through its paces. The Apollo Light underwent water and alcohol abrasion tests, soft bending trials to ensure it isn't cracked in your back pocket when you're taking a seat. The light was also subjected to thousands of repetition tests on the handset's buttons as well as USB Type-C ports. Verni has also shared footage of drop tests and tumbling to showcase just how robust their $300 phone is. Finally, revolutionary transport infrastructure firm Hyperloop One envisions their technology forming the backbone of a new Silk Road, with cargo Hyperloop whisking freight from China to Europe in a day. The ambitious vision could reduce freight transit times from the current 20 days. If you've got any suggestions for show ideas or other requests, drop us a comment and don't forget to hit subscribe. That's all for this Wednesday. Keep your eyes peeled for our FlyPro X Eagle review and a visit to 3D Printer Micro Mini Toys offices later this month.